Two men peeked outside their windows. One looked up and saw shining stars. The other looked down and saw mud. This example was given in the book A Cluster of Quiet Thoughts by Frederick Land Bridge, 1895. The world calls the stargazer an optimist and compliments him. That's the person who looks at the glass half full. The one looking down at the mud is labeled hopeless. He's a pessimist who would rather focus on the empty half of the glass and never look at the bright side of the picture. But by the end of 2020, a successful film released by Netflix named Don't Look Up made people think otherwise. Now the ones who look up are troublemakers, while the ones who look down are hopeful. The film's genre is sci-fi, drama, and comedy, which revolves around two astronomers who were letting the world know about the catastrophic danger the world was in. A dangerous comet was heading towards Earth, which would result in destroying the entire planet Earth. Neither the President of the United States of America nor the general public of the world took their warnings seriously and declared them lunatics on social media. When the comet got too close, world governments recognized their ignorance, but it was too late by then. The entire world collapsed with the exception of the 2,000 people who escaped on a spaceship. In the Arabic language, the one who warns is called Nadir. In this film, both astronomers were warners, or Nadir, whose work was worth listening to and accepting. If you look at the course of history, you'd find such warners trying to save humanity from such impending catastrophes. These warners were treated the same as the astronomers from the film, which is, nobody heeded to their warnings and labeled them as insane. These noble people were the prophets of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala sent by himself to let the humanity know about the life's reality and the catastrophe that follows it. But the majority didn't listen. To date, people who repeat the sayings of the prophets are declared insane, outdated and ignorant. Would the people who chanted don't look up take this matter seriously? Time, attention and a pure heart is all what's required. Just open the Qur'an al-Hakim. You will find the way to escape this danger.